Imagine driving down one of the most scenic highways in all of New Zealand, the Haas Pass Highway. And out of the corner of your eye, you see a sign that simply says, Imp Grotto. The name of a bridge as we're driving over it. And right after that sign, you see, not out of the corner of your eye, but out of your full eye, because you turned your head, because you're like, Imp Grotto, what is that? And you see a beautiful waterfall flowing into a clear emerald green pool. Imp Grotto. And at the top of that waterfall, you see a narrow crack and you just catch a glimpse behind there to see that it's deeper and it goes further back. Wouldn't you want to know what exactly is going on in Imp Grotto? Now, I'm not the biggest Lord of the Rings fan. I'll be the first to admit it. it seems like every person I meet in New Zealand is. It's been on TV or being played at hostels and hotels and guest houses basically every time I, I go somewhere. So it gets watched a lot here. Everyone is a big fan. It's okay, I'm not a huge fan. But anyway, even though I'm not a huge fan, seeing something called Imp Grotto makes you feel like you are in the Lord of the Rings. You know, I can just picture Gandalf saying to me, Bilbo Baggins, you must peer behind the mossy curtain of the Imp Grotto to find its secrets. Imp Grotto, the name, the waterfall, the glimpse that I saw conjures up such a, a myriad of possibilities. I had to know more about this. And I did find more. So the backstory is Sam and I were only gonna be in New Zealand for three months. This is back in February, 2020. But then the pandemic happened and they extended our visa, but still it was only extended for six months. So we didn't know how long we were gonna be here. We left our technical canyoneering gear at home. We didn't bring any with us. So it really limited our possibilities. But after I saw this Imp Grotto sign, I Googled it and found out that it is actually a technical canyon. And it's listed in the Canyoning New Zealand guidebook, which I got as a birthday present. Even though we didn't have technical gear, I wanted to use that guidebook to point us in the direction of some off the beaten track waterfalls that we could hike to. And there are some in the guidebook, mainly it's technical stuff, but there's a lot of what I would say, a good amount of stuff you can get to non-technically if you know how to read the topographic maps and you know how to read the beta. Um, I wouldn't recommend it for just anyone, but because I'm experienced, I knew what to look for. Anyway, I found Imp Grotto is a technical canyon. So in the back of my mind, I thought, oh man, if we had our technical gear, we could check that out. It also had beautiful pictures of this canyon. Fast forward, Two years later or a year and a half later, we've done some work. So we've expanded our budget a little bit. We were able to buy some gear here in New Zealand. And at the top of my list to return to was the stunning Imp Grotto. Now, the, one of the reasons why this canyon is so beautiful is it happens to occur on a fault line, which makes it really narrow and deep and gives some stunning rappels, a 21 meter rappel, a 40 meter, what they call a corkscrew rappel with just some beautiful pool and rock formations, crystal clear emerald water, and it's a really short canyon. So I plan on doing it at least one more time or two more times or several more times. Just, it's such a beautiful thing to be a part of. The first time I did it, I don't know if I captured it well enough, but I wanted to share that footage with you so that you could take a peek behind the mossy curtain of the Imp Grotto, this narrow, beautiful canyon that happens to occur on a fault line in Haas Pass, New Zealand.
Look at that. That is so beautiful. Amazing. Like a tourist? A tourist? <laughs> I am a tourist. A long-term tourist. Long-term. Make sure you step out far enough to the left. Woohoo! That's how you break your nose with a GoPro. <laughs> Just like that. I'm so excited talking about Imgrado that I'm fogging up my glasses. I hope you enjoyed this peer behind the mossy curtain into the Grotto of the Imps. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more videos, but in the meantime, get out there, find your adventure, and be infamous.